means to assist in pulling this matter together if there is to be repatriation. So tell me something, uh, and what sort of information you have gathered, because I know you would have met with Astra and some other persons, I mean, I mean, not going too much into the sensitive nature of the situation. We have met with um, several organizations, Muslim organizations. Uh, we, we, what we have discovered is that you have a, at least a hundred individuals uh, who are actually being held up in two camps tents and that kind of thing and um, the details of how they are kept and all of that we don't have such details because we are dealing with a situation that has come about as a result of a war ravaged country which is Syria and um, what we understand is they're not too far from the the Turkish border and that is about you know the most that we have gathered so far what we do, um, we, what we do understand is, or what we um, we think is required, is for further discussions and consultations um, at the international level, and we are yet to decide the agencies that are going to be involved, who may be of assistance to Trinidad and Tobago. We want um, for all of us to understand that this is a, a serious matter, it is a humanitarian crisis and we would wish that, you know, we would um, understand the, the sensitive nature of the situation and we will have some kind of national cooperation in, our, in the efforts that we plan to make um, because all indications are that the government would want to proceed um, by going forward towards uh, getting back our people um, to Trinidad and Tobago. We are uh, very concerned about the women folk and the children who are um, in that situation and we would think that Trinidad and Tobago would show its concern in that regard as well.